pride over happiness. When you live your life, you want to think about you being proudful of yourself rather than how happy you can be. What do I mean by this? What I mean is that you want to do as much work as possible so that you can feel the most proud of yourself over trying to self indulge in as much pleasure as possible so that you can be the happiest possible. I do not believe that you should be thinking about how happy you should be all of the time of every single moment, every single second. Because the thing about happiness is, is that happiness has value. And where I'm learning all of this is from Andrew Tate, who gives a lot of advice on life and how to live. And happiness has value, meaning that you can't just grab happiness out of the air and just grab it and just have it. And this is what all the pleasures, you know, sex, drugs, alcohol, good tasting foods, those are the things that are self-indulging, they're pleasurable, and you can just grab them like that. They're easy, they're completely easy. But when I talk about pride over happiness, I'm talking about you accomplishing something worthy of meaning. That's gonna make you happy. Listening to Andy Priscilla, he talks about how the harder you work, the happier you will be. And that's 100% the truth. If you're effing off in the day, you're not gonna feel good about yourself. You're not gonna feel proud about yourself. You're gonna think about pride over happiness. You're not gonna feel proudful of yourself if you're smoking weed, if you're distracted on Pornhub, and if you're drinking every single weekend, you're not going to feel proud of yourself. You will feel proud of yourself if you're going after your goals every single day, consistently, every single day with discipline, if you're consistently doing the right things on a daily basis, your habits are on point every single day on a daily basis, you're doing the right actions every single day, that's how you're gonna feel prideful. When you take these actions on a daily basis, you want to think about you know, your honor and your, and your ancestors and you wanna think about how can I make them proud? It's not even like making yourself proud. It's like, because if you don't even want to do it for yourself, then you have to do it for, for other people here. You can't indulge in all this pleasure all the time. It's just, not, it's not something you should be doing as a man. As a woman, I believe you can get into as much pleasure as you want because men and women are completely different. But if you're a man, you have to go through pain and struggle and you have to work and be prideful and accomplish something worthy you have to go after a mission every single day to actually achieve something worthy of your success something worthy of, of of you living because i've said it before nobody cares about you as a man nobody cares about you uh, unless you've achieved something of significance i mean just let's look at let's just look here at the best nba players of all time michael jordan lebron james and no one really talks about anyone else besides those two players. Everyone else besides those two players, LeBron James and Michael Jordan, about being the best NBA players of all time, no one talks about anyone else but them. Maybe Kobe Bryant. But what I'm saying is that, you know, you want to be the best. And to be the best, you're going to have to put in the most work. Those three gentlemen put in a tremendous amount of work to be the best in their industry. And it doesn't matter what industry you choose. What does matter is that you put in an extraordinary amount of work. And it doesn't matter what you do in life. You have to put in a, make the most amount of work as possible. It doesn't matter if you're waiting tables. It doesn't matter if you work for a moving company. It doesn't matter if you're a bus driver. Whatever you do, you need to do it to the best of your ability. And that is actually how you feel success. You're gonna feel prideful in this. You're gonna, this is how things change because like you see people who will just work, you know, quote unquote, a dead end job because they don't take pride in it and they hate their lives and they whatever, because they're not taking pride in these small little things every single day. If you can take pride in actually working your absolute hardest on these quote unquote, dead end jobs, then it's not going to be a dead end job because your mindset is gonna be so powerful and so constructive that you're gonna beat every single obstacle possible that comes in your way with that job, you know, with creating enough money to support yourself and your family and your future.
because you have that tenacity just to grind every single day the hardest you possibly can, taking pride in everything you do. If you do this, I mean, you're not going to be broke. No one wants to be broke. The more money you have, the more you don't have to think about money. You don't have to think about where your next paycheck is going to be. Think about pride over happiness. Work over happiness. And you're going to be happy because pride equals pride and work will equal, equal you and accomplishment will equal you being happy. That is the video I have for you. If you like this video, like the video, comment, share this video if it helped you, subscribe, turn your post notifications on, and we'll see you in the next one.